Welcome back to SourceFed, I'm Candace. And I'm Steven. And I'm Ava. Are you ever at the polls and you're like, oh fuck, I'm hungry. Oh, all the time, Ava. Well, guess what? I'm Ava Gordy and you can actually get a pizza ordered straight to your hot tummy at your polling location. Steven was at the polls, waiting in line to cast his vote to change America for the better or the worse. His sweat cascaded betwixt his supple eyebrows as the California sun beat down on his giant forehead. He said, I'm a hungry boy. I wish I had a slice of pie. Pizza pie. He looked to his right and noticed an odd looking woman. She was holding exactly what Stephen's heart desired, a pizza. She said, here's your pizza. <laughs> it came from pizza to the polls. Polls dot pizza. Stephen grabbed the pizza. He began to eat. Oh, shit. Pizza to the polls? I never would have thought. The end. It's a website called Pizza to the Polls, and if you're facing a long line on election day, all you have to do is go to polls.pizza. Pizza. How do they get dot pizza? I want Candace Carazales dot where's my dad? And I want Steven Subject dot is it a boy or a girl? Ooh, ooh, I got one. Really good one. How about Ava Gordy dot is it a boy or a girl? Steven just said that. But it still fits. Steven, Ava, Steven just said that. Ava. <laughs> <laughs> As of 10.14 a.m. PST, they have raised $20,000 and have given away 420 pizzas. Blaze it. So far, Freedom Pizzas have been sent all over the United States, including the heart of the nation, Evanston, Illinois. I'm from Columbus, Ohio, and I thought I was the heart of the nation. I'm a little confused. What the hell? They use the website SliceLife.com to find local pizza places nearest to the polls because it allows them to tip without needing someone to sign for the delivery. They mentioned if there are any funds left over, the money will go towards an undecided charity. They're asking donors for ideas about which charity to give to, so if you're interested, hop on over to their website and tell them not to give to Red Cross. Their Twitter account, at Pizza to the Polls, can keep you updated on where they're giving away pizza. So if you needed one more reason to vote, there you go. Not all is chaos today, as it seems. Pizza to the Polls is but another reason the United States is a beautiful country, in addition to Kenneth Bones and Dwayne The Rock Johnson from my favorite comedy of 2016, Central Intelligence. Why did it get such bad reviews? I do not know. It was very funny. Kevin Hart was a riot. Dwayne The Rock Johnson was great in it. He was funny in ways I never Steve. thought in ways I never Steven. thought. Hey, Steven, what's actually uh, your problem? Do you guys like Steven Septic? I love him. We're related. Do three people on a white wall make you uncomfortable? Do three people on a white wall make you uncomfortable? Do three people on a white wall make you uncomfortable? Do three people on a white wall make you uncomfortable? Do three people on a white wall make you uncomfortable? Do three people on a white wall make you uncomfortable? And hey, today might be election day, but it's also the last day to get 10% off these high quality snapbacks from 4humanpeoples.com. They feature custom printed bills like this space one and this one over here and a 3D embroidered FHP logo. Go get yours today at fhpmerch.com slash fhphats. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'm gonna go with C. Men do not have to register. Damn it! Um, let's, uh, I guess I'm gonna have to say that, uh, ooh-wee, it is the best show on Netflix right now, I'd say. I, before I go to sleep, I've been watching old cartoons. Like what? Tom and Jerry.